Hello friends, how are you all? In today's video, we will learn about jailbreaking PS4 and the features of latest Gold Hen. To jailbreak PS4, you will need a disc. If you are unable to find the disc, then you can contact me. As you can see, my all games are locked. But before proceeding to the jailbreak process, let's check the firmware version. Open the settings, then scroll down. Click on system, then system information to get the firmware version. My firmware version is 12.00. It means my PS4 is jailbreakable. This Blu-ray disc jailbreak is supported firmware version 9.00 to 12.02. Now let's insert the Blu-ray exploit disc. As you can see, the disc icon is appearing on above right-hand side. And you also needed the USB flash drive to load the golden. Here's a jailbreak disc. Before pressing X on it, let's go to the computer. You need a USB flash drive to copy the payload file in it. Connect your flash drive in your PC. Right-click on the flash drive to its format. It's in FAT32 and we need to format this drive in XFAT. Right-click on it and click on Format. Choose here to XFAT and click on Start. Now your flash drive is ready. Now copy the golden payload file in flash drive. Copy this file into your flash drive and rename it to payload.bin. Latest golden file download link in in the description. Now eject your flash drive and connect in your PS4. Click X on the disk to run the jailbreak. First notification. Second notification. Third notification, which means the jailbreak is loaded successfully. Now press the PS button to close the disk. Right now, you people have to close the disk manually, but in the next update of Gold Hen, it will close automatically after running the disk. Click on Enable BD App Auto Kill. You can see in this image and now eject the flash drive. It's not needed anymore until the next update of Golden is released. Now let's explore the Golden. Download the PKG games of your choice and copy into your hard disk. Make sure the hard disk is formatted in XFAT. Install the game from Package Installer and enjoy. Let's try this auto update, date and time function. Just click on it to activate next time system will give another notification of date and time update. While you're running the Blu-ray disc, make sure that the internet connection is active in your PS4. Set up your internet connection. Now let's restart your console. To jailbreak again your PS4, but this time you only needed to run the exploit. Blu-ray disk USB flash drive not needed anymore. Before jailbreaking, 
Check whether your internet connection is active or not. Our internet connection is still active and connected. Now uncorrect the time to know the auto time update function is working correctly or not. Now the time is 10.50 and I am setting this time on 8. Now let's see if it automatically corrects the time or not. Press X to launch the jailbreak disk of your PS4. First notification. Second notification. Third notification is for auto time update. Press PS button to exit this screen. Close the disk. Now check the time above right hand side, it means this feature is truly working. All correct. Now let's check the block firmware updates feature in Goldhen. Now go to the system software update. Make sure that your PS4 is still connected to the internet. Click here to update the firmware. 12.52 is added to downloads. But the gold hen is blocked. The firmware updates while your PS4 is still connected to the internet, which means your PS4 is safe. If you have any questions, then comment below and I hope you liked the video. Like and subscribe. I will see you in the next video.